Hi guys, so I wanted to let you guys know before I go ship this out right now, I went to go send out this letter. Legit, like a letter. It's not even thick. It's just a letter, so I just need like a stamp or two. And I went to DHL, and basically they told me that this, and it's going to the USA. It's not going to somewhere like Africa or something like that. Literally, $37, 36 something like that. $36 to send this out, $40 for a letter, for like two stamps. I was like, uh, I'll go to Canada Post and it'll be like $1.55, but let's see. Look, $1.26. So that took um, 35 seconds to do and $1.26. Yeah, there you guys go, $1.26 and she was trying to charge me like $36. You know, shop around if you're gonna send out things for shipping. And they also tried to tell me that the zip code was invalid, it wasn't actually a real zip code at the other place. I was like, uh, yeah it is. And I was, and I even went on Google and Google just the address and the zip code popped up on Google. So I'm like, eh, look, like, this is actually real. I think she knows her own zip code. Well, I didn't say that, but you know, I just thought it was a little weird to be charging me almost $40. Like when I sent Nina and Sabrina the packages out, that was like $40 at Canada Post. So thank goodness for Canada Post. Rant Adventure for <laughs> and rant for one day. Gas went up. So many people have already said they're coming no, I know, to the meetup. I've seen that on Twitter. They're just blowing up. I'm so excited. I know, me too. There was one person. They were like, "Nobody's gonna meet you. They're only gonna meet decap. I hope you miss your flight. Holy. You stupid bitch." Yeah, yeah, I got that comment. I was like, "Okay." <laughs> I was like, holy, just real mad at themselves. <laughs> I think they were just having a bad day. Yeah, that's literally what it said. I was like, holy. Wow. Okay. Well, well, we're not going to miss our flights. Well, thank you very Yeah, I, did, I didn't understand that. I was like, we're not going to miss our flight. That's funny. <laughs> it's actually, I got a laugh out of it. Well, I'm going to miss my flight, but you're not. Okay. Yeah, okay. Pretty sure we're going together. <laughs> that's so funny. At least I thought so anyway, yeah. but whatever. Hello. So um, I'm about to make supper, but I'm gonna give Cooper a treat because he loves these. I don't know if I've shown these before in the vlog. These are completely raw. So he's a vegan. <laughs> what? These are rabbit ears. Uh, and he's gonna eat them. Cooper loves these rabbit ears. Like he jumps for them. Yeah, but I had to have, let him have it outside. So you're gonna have this outside, right? Because if he eats it in here, then Shugzi will just take it from him. Okay? Shugzi will have his own treats. Yummy, yummy, it's favorite gets his cool skin. Hi guys, we got some interesting news. <laughs> very, very spur of the moment, but I will let Decap explain. I went to my mom's today to feed Alaska and she was gone. She got away and she has no collar, no nothing. So we're going to get her and take her home to our house. New doggy, <laughs> kind of. She's gonna be ours because he says that she's just gonna stay with us now. They gotta get their backyard done. Yeah, they don't have a backyard. It's just basically not set up for a dog. It's just all like kind of dirt and we have grass. We have a renovation. Yeah, we have a big backyard. We've got a new doggy. We don't know. If, oh, that they almost close. hit each other up there. We don't know for how long this is gonna be. It may be for a week. It might be for a month. It might be forever. We're just not sure. Um, but you guys will know if you follow us daily in the vlogs. Update you guys for sure. But yeah, she got out last night at about like 8 p.m. Well, they said they've had her since nine last night, so who knows when time, what time right. she got out. I would just assume she maybe got around out around eight, but yeah, she could have got out. Because when were you there to feed her? I was there about five-ish. Okay, so she was there at five, and then these people found her. Actually, that's a funny story. Um, so he, he went there just to check on her as I was making supper, and then all of a sudden he's like, Alaska's gone. I said, what do you mean? What do you mean Alaska's gone? He checked the yard. We thought maybe somebody took her, but yeah, she got out because again, like their yard just really isn't set up for a dog. Um, so she got out. Well, where is she? How are you supposed to find her? So I, I went I went and drove around for probably an hour just around looking through the parks and at least everywhere I could just to see if I could find her, but she didn't turn up. And then I phoned the SPCA and the um, animal capture unit. I forget what they're called. Animal control. Animal control. I found I phoned both of those. Um, the SPCA was closed and the animal control said they just get animals and bring them to the SPCA. There was kind of no way of knowing because the SPCA had closed actually 20 minutes prior. Should we just keep looking? Should we maybe post on Facebook or maybe put posters up or something? And then... I called 
told my dad to tell him just to keep an eye out because he lives in the same area. And then it was about 20 minutes later, my stepmom Michelle actually sent me a picture of a post on Facebook. Somebody has her and was looking for her owners. And he's like, yeah, that's Alaska. And I have pictures of her and we have videos, you guys know. So we're like, yeah, yeah, that's her, that's her. And we know that that's her. So he phoned the number on the post. We're glad that the lady on the phone was just like, oh yeah, come get her. She said, you know, like, what's her name? Oh yeah, like she how drove old me. Is, yeah, how old is she and all that? That's good. Because then she just wasn't going to give her away to whoever. And we have pictures and videos. So if this lady wants to see it, like, that's actually Alaska. And you guys know, you guys, some of you might be saying, well, why doesn't his mom just go get her? Why did she get out? still on. Yeah, there's still on vacation. That's why I'm still looking after her. Gonna go grab her, so I'm so excited. I don't know exactly where, where the street is, but <laughs> I know what it's off of. We'll have to GPS it. If we get there and it's like, oh, that's actually not her. It just looked like her in the picture. It'll be her. <laughs> It'll be her, but like, there's always a possibility. There's Alaska. Oh wait, you can't really <laughs> see. Oh, her face is like right there, kind of. It was actually her. I was so excited when we saw her. She was so excited. Love Alaska, her. are you in the car? Good. Hey, babies. Here's Alaska. Aww. <laughs> Little brat. And I showed the lady pictures of Alaska and I. Yay, she's with us. She doesn't like going in the car. It's weird. Oh, she hated getting in the car, but now that she's in the car, she's fine. Yeah, but usually dogs, if you're like car ride, they're like, yes. <laughs> <laughs> so Alaska's here. She's out running around, checking things out. What do you think? Checking everything out. Smelling Cooper, because Cooper's, this is his yard still. He's got it marked. Look. Look, you can play! Oh, she's so <laughs> she can actually run. Did you see her run for the first time? Mm -hmm. Like before she could, she just had to walk. She can actually stretch her legs. See if she and wants run. that. What's this? What's that? <laughs> What's that? <laughs> oh. <laughs> no, she'll just be exploring. So. Her tail's up though, she's happy. Alaska. She likes it here. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Is that your new toy? Oh. <laughs> She's so happy. Look at you. She's actually running. <laughs> oh, Alaska, you're such a suck. Oh, who is that, Alaska? Any kisses? Any kisses? Hi, <laughs> and we got a guard dog. He really wants to go for a go walk. For a walk. <laughs> Should we go for a walk with Alaska? So we had the meet. You want to tell it? Oh, they were awesome. They were do they did really well together. So we're just gonna take them for a walk. <laughs> take them for a walk. <laughs> Poopy sack. Well, we took them for a walk. Yeah, Cooper and Alaska are getting along very good. Very good, actually. I just took him outside. Have her on the leash while he's outside with her just for now for them to get acquainted or whatever. And they were playing together and pouncing around, so that's good. Mm -hmm. We took them both for a walk together and they were good with that. He's going to take some getting used to. <laughs> he's a little hissy and growly, but, but he keeps... she's... She's a lot bigger than, than Cooper, obviously, yeah. so she's a little more intimidating to him. Yeah, but he goes up to the door and we open it just a crack so they can actually see each other. And Shugzy just looks at him and growls, but stays there. He growls and he kind of backs up and then he's like, Okay, hey, well, I'm kind of interested, so I'm kind of just going to stick my head in here. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so... Yeah, you'll get used to her. So we have three animals now. We are going to get going now. Yeah, going to go to bed, hopefully go to work tomorrow. It's been very slow for his work, but... Oh, well. Wow. Oh, well, at least he has us. And Alaska now. And Alaska. Our family's growing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. We'll talk to you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye. Okay, we're ready to go. Oh, my God. Vegan. What is wrong with you? Vegan. <laughs> oh so this is our cart. <laughs> it, it was full.